What is that? What is that? <laughs> what is that? Hello guys, it's me Tori and welcome back to my channel for another video. So, somebody gifted me The Sims for Spa Day and Bowling Night stuff and I thought since you guys liked my review of The Sims for Outdoor Retreat, I thought I would do like a little review of The Sims for Spa Day and Bowling Night stuff and Nifty Knitting when it comes out later. <laughs> so, welcome to The Sims for Spa Day. Okay, so we've got some things to read out. Wellness skill. Sims can master their mind, body and emotions. Improve the skill through yoga, massage, meditation, oh and meditation to unlock the power to freeze needs. <gasps> Ooh. And teleport. Oh my god, I didn't know about this. Go with the flow with yoga. Attend classes at a spa and master everything from the half moon pose to the lord of the dance pose to hone your sims inner wellness. Massage, steam, unwind. Work out your sims tension through a variety of massages. Kick back in the sauna or soak in a mud bath to soothe your cares away. Enjoy it all at the spa. The new spa venue type will re-energise even the most stressed sims. Oh, good. My sims are always getting stressed when they come home from work because I'm always making them work that little bit hard. But now we can de-stress. Nice. Choose from free pre-built venues or build your own. Okay, <laughs> that sim is a mood. Okay, I'm excited to see this. So... So we're going to do what I normally do, which is jump on into creator sim, look at the creator sim items, then look at the build mode, and then look at the gameplay items. So I am very excited. Let's start a new game. Okay, let's look at the new hairstyles from The Sims for Spa Day. Okay, so we have three hairstyles for female adult sims. We have this tied up hairstyle, which I mean is perfect for yoga. It's just very like fitness chic. <laughs> is that a thing? I have no idea. But there it is. I'll go through all the swatches and you can see what this hair looks like in all swatches because maybe you don't have spa day yet and you want to buy it in the three hours that are left in the sale. I, It's three hours left of the sale for me, apparently. It looks very cute. I, I like this watch with the blue and the... I like this hair a lot, actually, especially in that, like, bluey colour. It makes me want to play, like, the Not So Berry Challenge. I don't know why. Like, this looks kind of minty to me. I like it. Then the next hair we have is this one. It's a very cute hair. I've seen this on a lot of Sims, and I've wondered which pack it comes from. And, yeah, it's very cute. I like this a lot. Also, I want to say thank you so much to the person who gifted me this pack. They are one of my subscribers, and honestly, this means such a lot to me, so thank you. I love this hair so much. I just keep on spinning her around. <laughs> and then the next one is this lovely plait braid hair. I think it's very, very cute. I like it a lot. I This is probably my favourite hair from the pack. I've wanted this hair in my game for goodness knows how long. Oh my god, giving me Elsa vibes. Honestly, girl is a queen. I I love that. I love that for her. And then I think we have... Oh, <laughs> we have this head wrap, which, I mean, is perfect for the spa. <laughs> Obviously, you wouldn't use this hair, this hat on your sims in regular, normal gameplay. But you would definitely use these hairs, I think. These have great usability, which, I mean, for any sims pack, is great. Okay, now we're going to look through some outfits. Oh, gosh. This game is trying my patience today, I'm telling you. So, first, we have a cute jumper. Unfortunately, it clips with the hair, which I think is a little bit strange, considering they both come from the same pack. So, hmm, why are you not making it compatible? Hmm. <laughs> but it comes in these really nice, cool swatches, and this is something I could definitely see myself giving a lot of my sims, because it's very, like, good for athletic wear. I can imagine my sims having this. To be honest, I think after today I'm going CC free. <laughs> then we have this top. Oh, I'm glad I have this top. I think I might need this for a creator sim I'm doing soon. Not to give any spoilers, but I think this might be, might be good. Okay, 
So I don't know how many times you would use this top. Maybe you could use it for like swimwear. You could pair it with like a swimming up. I don't know. <laughs> I am not really a stylist. Oh my god, I love this top. This is like a sports bra. It's very cute. I like it. It's good. Comes in a nice range of swatches. These older packs really do have good swatches. I don't think the new packs can relate. Ooh, tea. <laughs> and then we have another. We're going to have loads like this. This game is trying the patience. I'm trying to record videos and it's like, nah, heck no. You are not recording videos today, sunshine. And then we have this top. This top is cool as well, very spa-like. These are very athletic-y sort of tops, so I thought The Sims was struggling for athletic wear, but it's okay. I don't- <laughs> I think- I think this is a good pack to have. I, there's a lot of cast items for a game pack. As for usability, I think you can probably use them for athletic wear, so if you've got a Sim that likes working out, very nice. Oh, and this jumper's cool. You could definitely just use this as a normal top, like- I like this jumper a lot actually. I I like it. Got a nice range of swatches. The cast is killing it so far. Oh, yellow. Gotta make her wear the yellow. Like yellow a lot. <laughs> yeah, cast is good with this pack. Okay, let's look at the female trousers and whatever. Okay, so we have these trousers. They're just like normal standard jogging trousers. I mean, they're okay. I like that you can either have the stripe or you can not have the stripe. I think that is a good thing about it. I think they're very cute. I could use, I imagine using these for sleepwear. I can imagine this as like a sleepwear outfit. I'm glad that we've got a lot of different options here. These outfits are genuinely giving me life. I like them a lot. I think this is nice. Oh, I like these. Just like some standard trousers. Nice. We need Okay, and then we have these sports trousers giving me Discover University vibes. Did Discover University copy this pack with some of its cast? Yes, maybe. But I think this is cool. I like these. I like the swatches that they come in. Oh, and these shorts are so adorable. Okay, let's just quickly remove the top so that you can see these trou shorts. You can see the patterns on them. You can either have them plain or with a cute little pattern on them. I like that we have choice. Having choice is good. <gasps> oh, that gets paired with the top, doesn't it? Uh, this one. Oh, you could definitely wear that for swimwear. Oh, definitely. Oh, I like it. I, I like that a lot. I like that you can do that. Um, very good. And I can imagine... Wait, this is good for athletic wear and sports wear and possibly hot weather as well. And then you got that jumper. Oh, you can definitely reuse these outfits. Like, I thought, oh, spa day? Hmm, don't know how I'm going to reuse these outfits. Definitely good. Thank you so much for gifting me this pack. <laughs> okay, let's look at these shots. Oh, we've got some fancy patterns going on here. I like it a lot. Okay, very nice. And then we have some other shorts Ooh, they're very low waisted i feel like those were originally made on male sims and then converted for female sims because they don't really fit her frame but i mean you do you hun <laughs> and then we're gonna look at the full body outfits oh and this pack is killing it with these outfits for swimwear look at this swimwear outfit that's a little risque for my liking but my sims can definitely pull this off this girl can pull this off she's looking fab with the swimsuit on and i like it and we've got that oh that red's cool then we've got a little dressing bath robe thing nice because the one with the base game is not as cute as this i'm telling you my sims are going to be wearing this from now on. This is good for another sleepwear outfit. <gasps> Look at the yellow. I'm sorry. I like yellow, in case you didn't know. And then we got this dress. Oh my god. It's like, is it like a towel wrap thing? This, I feel like, has multiple uses again. Cass killed it with this pack. I'm telling you right now, Cass is good. Oh, is this new with this pack? Oh, we have a little watch. Nice. The Sims don't have as many watches as I would like. Okay. I like the watch. I'm glad we have that. Okay. And then we have some new shoes. I'm expecting trainers with this. Um, possibly slippers, but mainly trainers. Let's have a look. 
Ah, there we go. Some nice trainers. The Sims could literally give me trainers in every single pack, which I swear they do, and I would not be mad. Like, The Sims has too many jumpers, <laughs> but the trainers, I am living for them. Genuinely, all I dress my Sims in is trainers. <laughs> so, I mean, if you can keep giving me some more Sims team, I would not be saying no. <gasps> I miss the yellow. Why did I... They're so good. <laughs> We have a lot of different styles as well. I like and then we got like some more flat casual shoes And then we got like some little sandals. I think they're cute. This outfit's cute for hot weather I think that's kind of cute. I think that's all the Creator sim stuff for female sims. Okay. I like this outfit a lot on her Just randomize some traits for her. Oh, she's evil Oh, we stand. So we're gonna look at the creator sim items for male sims. So we have this hair, which looks like he's kind of pulling on the top, which is, it's good to see something different. And then we have this hair. I think we have a lot of hairs like this in the sims. And then this hair, which gives me James Charles vibes. And then let's look at the creator sim. We have an equal amount of tops for male and female sims, which, I mean, we love to see it. Yes, sims team, you killed it with this pack, I'm telling ya. Oh my god, this sim is so buff. <laughs> and we got a nice football shirt kind of deal going on. And a jumper thingy. I'm gonna go through them quickly. I swear we have a tank top, which looks like this already. I don't know, <laughs> I'm pretty sure we do. Then we have a crop top thing going on. I think this is kind of cool. <laughs> and then we have this tank top, which we also have for feminine framed sims. And I'm not gonna go through all the color swatch options cause there's so many of them. <laughs> we'll go through them quickly maybe, I don't know. I like them. And then I think we've got some new shoes for them. Oh, these are cool, they're snazzy, ooh, like those. <laughs> I just like snazzy trainers, you know? And then we have a bathrobe for male sims, because we're not going to forget that, are we? Nope. Okay, so we have no hairstyles, no new hairs for kid sims. We do have this head wrap, which is good. Kind of sad that we have no hairstyles for them. We only have this one top which is a little bit sad. Um, so in Compared to other packs, Children are lacking a little bit in their creator sim, which is a bit sad. Um, they have bathrobes though, which suggests that kids can still get a spa treatment. So that is something I would be incredibly upset and irritated if the kids could not go to the spa. Um, I hope they can have a spa treatment as well, because otherwise that would be a bit sad. And we got no new shoes for kids. So kids... Get a total of three creator sim items, which is a little bit sad. Four. Four creator sim items, which is a little bit sad because I think they deserve better than this. Um, I, I feel bad for Elizabeth France. Um, she deserved better, really. <laughs> My poor child. <laughs> she deserved better than this. Okay, so that was all the creator sim items for spa day. I mean, I don't know how I feel about this so much because there's not that many things they could generally wear for every day and I'm a little bit sad that kids don't have that many creator sim items. Again, this is going to be an honest review. I am completely honest when I review things, so... <laughs> Creator Sim, I would give it a 7 out of 10. I think it's pretty nice. I just wish that kids had more Creator Sim items, really. But now we're going to go and move on to the build and buy mode. Okay, we're going to do something different today. We're going to play in winter. I don't know why I did this. <laughs> I don't normally like playing in winter. But, I mean, we'll do it today. Okay, so we are going to go and look at the build and buy mode items for the sims for spa day i'm excited to look at these please excuse my incredibly glitchy build and buy mode on my computer it does not like it do, 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 do. Spa day. oh spa day comes with a lot of different pre-made rooms so if you're one for 
not liking building or cluttering up places and stuff. I really want to make a house with pre-made rooms again. I think that would be fun. You have a lot of rooms that you can use. This is definitely what I did when I first started playing The Sims because I didn't want to be doing all this. Oh, we got some counters. Oh, yes. Oh my god. I didn't realise this game pack came with counters. Also, this is kind of nostalgic for me, which, I mean, hear me out, okay? When I first played The Sims, I got The Sims free play in 2016, and it was in the middle of the spa event. Because The Sims free play, I don't know if you're familiar or not with that game, it has a lot of different events. And we were in the middle of a spa event, and literally the spa stuff looks like all this. And it's like, oh my god, and it was cool. And I literally made my Sims have like the most luxu luxurious houses ever. Like the toddler's room was boring, and my adult Sims had like a big spa bathroom. <laughs> and I literally spent all my money on like <laughs> everything I could possibly have. Oh my god. I love this. This brings back memories. I <laughs> this is so nostalgic to me. I I love this so much. Okay, so we have this Ottoman. It's very cute and I'm going to just place it here. It's a decent size actually. Sometimes they make things a little bit too big. Oh, the escape key's not going to work for me today. Don't be doing that. <laughs> then we have this stool. The swatches seem like they will match a lot of things, which is good cuz the Sims 4 does not necessarily have the best wood swatches and it makes us a little bit mad as Simmers. We don't like it. We have a nice chair. Ooh, there's a chair. <laughs> I like it though. Look, we can get wellness skill from it. We can do hands and feet. I'm guessing pedicures and manicures. Sometimes they get them mixed up like which is which. <laughs> chair in the corner oh i want to build a kid's school with this i feel i don't know why i'm thinking of that we get a bar stool good job i like it we'll be using this this is kind of like mid-century is it i don't know i don't normally do a lot of mid-century stuff i might build a mid-century house with like bowling night stuff oh my god i feel like bowling night stuff is mid-century isn't it this will go so so well with this pack oh my god thank you to the person who gifted me these <laughs> I will do a bowling night stuff review soon, I promise. Then we have a thing. Um, apparently you sit on it. Um, okay. <laughs> what is it? I don't know what it is. Um, <laughs> now I can't use my escape key, apparently, which is great. Then we have another ottoman, which looks like a table. Can they sit on it then? Okay. Nice. A table that you can sit on. I need that in The Sims. Oh look, and we have a massager table. Let's create a lot of space because I want to see this in uh, live mode in a second. And these counters are so good. Ooh, these would go nice alongside the island living ones. Does anyone get like that vibe? I feel like these look better than the island living counters though because the island living counters are a little bit bad i will put this up on the wall in a second because it's a wall decor thing then we have a table oh i like it normally i hate most of these small tables like this because they look kind of dumb this one doesn't oh this is a table okay <laughs> some of the build and buy mode stuff is a little bit crazy i can imagine judith ward having some of this awesome cube what what even is that <laughs> you know what's awesome an awesome cube. You know what's more awesome? An awesome cube with an arbitrary break in its cubeness, providing an aesthetic disharmony to your awesome cube viewing pleasure. You know what's even more awesomer? You can put stuff on the awesome cube because it's an end table. Oh yeah. Well, <laughs> who writes the descriptions for these things? Oh my god, this sink is crazy. I don't get the aerodynamics of this at all. Like, where does the water go? crazy <laughs> and then we have an oh my god too cool for number t oh my god an even crazier toilet <laughs> and then we have a shower very good for a spa I can imagine this in like a public toilet if you're trying to create a gym very nice oh this would be good for a gym okay and then this bath is nice okay i i like that bath <laughs> i i don't know why i have to get so detailed i'm like hmm i like that bath hmm <laughs> 
<laughs> and then we have another bar. Ooh, this reminds me of the one in The Sims Free Play so much. And I love it. Like, th that game was my everything, genuinely. And then we have a yoga mat, which requires a lot of space around it. Oh, it's green. It's gone. Whew. We're glitching out today, aren't we, guys? Oh my god, I'm telling you. I like this yoga mat. Ooh, that design's nice. I like it. Very nice. Then we have a thing. I don't know what that is, but okay. <laughs> I'm guess. Oh, it's a stool. Oh, a meditation stool. Okay. Nice. Love that. Then we have some fish. <laughs> This is like rich person stuff, genuinely. I want to build a rich person mansion. If my game would let me, that is, because it's glitching out right now. Then we have an aquarium. That's like a more expensive one. It's very nice. I just put the aquarium down and it's glitching again. Stop! Oh, look, a sauna. Nice. I'm kind of sad that you can't individually place the pieces because in The Sims Free Play, you can individually place them. We've got like a granite one and a wood one. We have some more exercise stuff, which is great. Like, you could build a gym with this pack. Honestly, I think this pack is better than fitness stuff. I'll probably be disabling fitness stuff out of my game because <laughs> I need it to run faster and... If you have this pack and you're thinking of getting fitness stuff, maybe don't. Or if you don't have this pack or fitness stuff, get this one over fitness stuff. Because it has more in it. So it's better value for money. <laughs> the rock climbing wall isn't worth it. Then we even have a bar as well. Because, I mean, who doesn't want to get a nice juice when they go to liquid beef bar? I don't know what this is. What is it? Oh, a drink tray. Very nice. We have one of those with um backyard stuff as well. So that's kind of cute. I felt, yeah, we've got like spa stuff, sports stuff, drinks. Maybe get these over backyard and fitness stuff. Because I mean, this is, oh, that's a wall decoration. We have a nice vase. We've got some very nice vases. This pack's good and I completely underestimated it. Well then. <laughs> what is that? What is that? <laughs> what is that? I love this. That needs to go on a wall as well. Why is so much of it wall decorations? Oh my god. There's a lot of wall decorations with this pack. An incense holder, very nice. Oh my god, there's so many wall decorations. Okay, there's some weird floor thing. And it's got like a corner piece. I don't know what that's for. Lotus rug, wait, illuminated. Oh, it glows. How cute is that? Oh, I love this pack. I would definitely recommend this over fitness stuff any day. Like, I know it's more expensive than fitness stuff, but it's way... It, like, it's way better value for money than fitness stuff. <gasps> oh my god, this fence is cute! Look at this, that is cute. We got some nice swatches, like actual good swatches, okay. I like it, we got a nice fence, oh we got steps. Those are some decent steps actually, I'm going to put these in my sims builds a lot actually. And we got some fountain things, probably won't let me place them because I don't have a fountain. And only be placed in fountains. Well, you've seen it, so it doesn't really matter. We got a sphere thing. Look at that. That's cool. And a slab. I don't know what you need a slab for, but it's great. If you like Get Famous, I feel like this would go so well. Like Judith Ward, she deserves a spa treatment, maybe. <laughs> oh my god, there's big doors as well. This pack has a lot of doors. <laughs> And, oh, these are nice wind. ooh, frosted windows. I like that. I wish it would show up with the door. I like the frosted windows. They're kind of cool. Oh, we have, oh, we have a lot of wind. We have windows for tall and medium wall height. So if you like building on tall and medium wall height and you like modern stuff and get famous and all that, I would definitely recommend this pack because I feel like it's definitely right up your alley. Ooh. <laughs> that's bright these are good for modern builds i'm telling you this now great for modern builds this is a pack for builders and i said i don't know probably more than creator sim 
I, it's also good if you like sims that are into fitness and stuff. I don't think we have any trees and stuff, which is kind of sad because I can imagine trees in a spa. Oh, I didn't put up all the wall decorations. That is my bad. I think this is pretty much all of the build and buy mode items in the game. There is a lot. <laughs> As you can see, there is a lot. A heck of a lot. Um, couldn't even fit it all on my lot properly. <laughs> I think when they have a bath, there's like bath bombs now? <gasps> take a bath with soaks, take a mud bath. Ooh, it costs money. Oh my god, citrus soak, rose petals. Re Muscle relaxing so wait, does that mean when they get fatigued they can unfatigue themselves? <laughs> Ooh, I will have to try that one out. That is good. And then you get lavender foam and then milk, honey, and oatmeal. Oh my god, this is genuinely rich people stuff. Like 30 simoleons a pop? Whoa. Okay. Well, don't be doing that. I haven't got my screenshot for my thumbnail or anything. Okay, let's go for rose petals. I want to see if they get like a flirty mood look from that. I think so. I don't know why I'd be having a bath outside, but it's okay. Doesn't matter. I am not going to be judging. It's fine. No, no one will see him. He, he's okay. <laughs> oh my god, look at the rose petals. Oh my god, he's even put cucumbers over his eyes. Oh my god. <laughs> Imagine having a bath outside in the snow. Oh my god. Oh my god, he's got a face mask. Oh my god, I love it. I love I love it. Face masks are <laughs> these type of face masks are like my favorite thing ever. I used to use a lot of these and I haven't really been looking after my skin so much recently, but I mean, face masks. <laughs> oh, he does get flirty from that. Oh, nice. Good. Flirty. And he gets a flirty mood that lasts a whole eight hours. Well, if your sims are going on a date, this is probably just what you want. <laughs> I remember when face mask used to mean these things. <laughs> oh my god, the water is literally blue. I want to see what mood look she gets from that. And she just gets a happy mood look from that, which is okay. I don't know what other mood looks they could potentially get. But, I mean, that's kind of cool. Okay, we got some more stuff to explore quickly before I end the video. Hire a massage therapist. They can have a massage over there. I'm not really that interested in that, to be honest, right now. Ooh, hand and foot massage. <laughs> okay. Let's see them have a foot massage. Ew. <laughs> That's like my worst nightmare, honestly. I cannot stand the idea of people touching my feet. But, I mean, you do you, hun. If you want to have a foot massage, then that's great. Let's see the mass. No, they can't get there. <laughs> Oh my god. Okay, so I think on that note I'm gonna have to go because my game is dying. The Sim is very pretty by the way. So what do I think of The Sims for Spa Day? I think it's cool that they can have a spa venue. I don't think you get to run the venue though which is pretty sad. Um, and there's like some fun gameplay stuff but I don't know that there's any like challenges and aspirations and stuff so I suppose that's kind of lacking a little bit but I do like the build and buy mode stuff that we have there. So what do I think of this pack? I like it. It's not my favourite game pack but it's not my least favourite game pack. I think it's cool, I love the creator sim, I do think it's worth the money. I like it. This hat is so cute by the way. I like it a lot. I do definitely think this game pack is worth the money. 
um, I would recommend this. I would probably put this around the middle when it comes to game packs, around the same kind of position as Outdoor Retreat. I would probably put this above Vampires and Strangerville, which are probably down there with my least favourite game packs. I like this pack, so yeah, that was my opinions. Um, let me know what you guys think. I would recommend this over a lot of stuff packs that often offer similar things like you could get fitness stuff or you could get this and this is a little bit more money but it has a little bit more for you to do so I would definitely recommend this over that. If you like Get Famous I would recommend it to you as I think it would go nicely with the Get Famous stuff. I think overall this is a fun game pack. So yeah, on that note, I think I'm going to go. Please don't forget to like and comment and subscribe if you haven't done so already. And let me know your opinions on this pack. And I hope you have a really good day. And I will see you guys next time.